Okay, hello guys, welcome to part two. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make, well of course, when you click the button it's supposed to go somewhere, but where is it gonna go? Well, we're gonna make the pages where it's gonna go right now. And we're only gonna make two pages because the home button's gonna go to one page and the anim button's gonna go to another page, but the site button isn't gonna go anywhere on the flash file. It's gonna go to your internet. So just make two more layers and make them above the layer fill but below your action script and buttons layers call one your first one home page and your second one anim page now your home page is going to be on layer two where you ask why can't it just be on layer one because layer one is where we have all the buttons and we want to make it to where you click on it it goes to another page which is on frame two so just press um, click on the home page layer and then on frame 2 which is the frame right after frame 1 right click the frame and say insert blank keyframe and here's where our home page is going to be as you see as you can see the um, navigation bar has disappeared well it hasn't disappeared it's still on layer 1 it's okay if it's not on layer 2 we're going to fix this later but for now let's just put something on our home page I'm just going to type in home page. Welcome. Blah. 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 This is nothing to do with anything. This is just something to put. And you can put whatever you want. You can just make a drawing if you want. So you just write home page if you want to. I'm, that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to write home page. Delete all this. Just right here. Just home page. I'm going to bring it down. <clears throat> and for Anim's page, I'm going to click on the Anim's page layer. And I'm going to, um, on frame 3, the frame right after the home page frame right here, I'm going to right click and say insert blank keyframe. And I'm going to make a little animation. My animation basically is just a little flare going up. So I'm just going to draw a line. 7, I'm going to hit my onion skin so I can see what I just did. So this is the whole animation I made. Isn't much, just just a little thing, so you know that something has happened. So I'm gonna come back to layer one, and here is my navigation bar. And I'm gonna give all of my buns instance names. Now, basically, what instance names are um, are in the actions, the code we're gonna write. Instance names basically say, oh, because as you can see, it's not um, ActionScript 2.0 anymore. If you're from ActionScript 2.0, like me, what you're used to is putting the actions on the button by clicking it and go to your actions and blah, blah, blah. This is totally different. You have to put your actions on a different layer, which is the ActionScript layer. All your actions are on this frame. It's way different than ActionScript 2.0. But when you do that, you're wondering, well, how are we gonna know? How how's um, Flash gonna know what t button we're talking about? And the instance name is basically that bridge that connects the action and the button together. So I'm gonna click on my home button and come to my properties panel. And right here, it should say instance name anywhere. You just look for whatever it says instance name and click on it. Click on the little bar so you can type. And I'm just gonna type home btn just make it nice and simple no um capitalizing no underscores just home btn click on anim come to instance name and call it anim btn and click on site come over to your instance name and just call it site btn all right so now that we've added our instance names all we have to do now is go to our action strip layer. This is the last step. So, okay. Well, so now all we gotta do is click um click on your site BTN layer and then click on frame 15 or your last frame, whatever frame um is your last frame. As you can see I have all these frames right here and then it ends right here. So I'm just gonna press F6. 
and then click um right under it so you're on your anim button layer whoops I accidentally add more frames click right there and press F6 and click on the home button layer click on frame 15 and press F6 so now your navigation bar is going to be on every single frame so now go to your action script and press F so now go to your action script and press F9 or go to window and go down to actions and now basically what you're going to want to say is the simple code to stop the layer from going because if we don't put this code let me show you go to control test movie it's not going to stop as you can see everything's playing all at once we don't want it to go play all at once it looks like it's flashing um, we want it to stop on the first frame so you can click and make it go somewhere so I'm just going to say stop open parenthesis close parenthesis and then just press the semicolon and basically that is our stop action so when we test our movie it stops on frame one